an apocalyptic earth, even if the sun burns out, if the sun, if someone plucked the sun out of the solar system and we fly off at a tangent into interstellar space, we will all die rapidly. But the life forms at the bottom of the ocean that are warm from the magma oozing up through the vents, they'll be just fine. They will survive the death of Earth's surface. So that's another source of energy. By the way, geothermal energy, because Iceland is sitting on a, on a, at the separation of two continental plates, they're almost entirely geothermally driven. Their carbon footprint is minuscule. They have so much energy, they send water under their streets so that it never gets icy in the winter. We don't need snow plows. Just heat the, heat the streets. Right. So, so that's another source of, it's renewable in the sense that it's like a near infinite supply of earth energy available to us. All right. Yes, it would one day run out, but not really because we had something to do with it. All right. It's the volcanoes got, <laughs> have you seen earth yeah. <laughs> get angry? All right. It's got a lot to kill us in the future. So that's another source of energy. 